welcome back fans of the show hopefully you guys had a good weekend so far uh i've had a sort of a good weekend it's not been the best but it hasn't been the worst either so that's uh good um hopefully you guys are having fun uh hopefully you guys enjoyed yesterday's stream because actually things went a little bit better for me than they have been lately on arc so um as you know a lot of people have watched we are only streaming on on we're only doing um twitch on the weekends and starting probably i think maybe even hey had chores yesterday that's fine everybody has things to do on the weekends i understand yeah i'm gonna be jumping in shortly um uh, there's a lot of changes that have happened since you've been off the server and I'm sorry that the server I still haven't fixed the settings yet so we're still struggling with that but uh, you'll notice that I'm not videos not in sync with your audio hmm why is that hmm I don't know why it's like that weird On the VOD too. Interesting. I don't know why. Give me a second here. I'll see if I can do this real time. It ha probably has something to do with a delay on my um on my cam. Let's see if we can fix that. Uh No, we don't want that. Um, see if that works. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Always some kind of technical issues. And it's a lot. Most of it has to do with the cam. And it's something wrong with my webcam. I think I'm going to have to get a new one in the near future. Uh, let's see if we can get this working properly. Uh... Oops. <laughs> that messed up my video a little bit. Uh, let's do this. Boom. It's still off. I don't know why. It's weird. I didn't notice it yesterday. I'm, I apologize. Uh, let's see if we can get this working properly. Okay. I think we got it. Might be a little off still. But I think we're all we're good. Anyway, uh, I apologize for all that. Um, no, I could get another camera. Just it's going to take a while. Uh, I see. I actually, what probably caused a lot of it is I was monkeying around with some of my settings, and I'm probably going to have to do that with uh, YouTube as well. So we're going to probably. Uh, probably be suffering through some technical issues because YouTube has a different for some reason YouTube streams at much higher bit rate than than um, uh, uh, Twitch does and I have to every time I stream I have to change everything so it always kind of messes things up and also, I stream at a much higher uh, frame, or not frame rate, um, resolution on Twitch and or on YouTube. So, yeah, YouTube, I'm, I'm actually doing it in 2K, 1440p at this point. I'm going to try, I might try, because I think my video card can handle it. I think I might give uh, 4K a shot. The problem is, I won't be able to see it because... My neither one of my monitors can do 4K, <laughs> so uh, I wouldn't be able to tell uh, the difference. So, and uh, but yeah, um, 
I'm going to have to make a couple of adjustments too once we get back into the game here. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be streaming on YouTube. Uh, I, I don't know about this week, but I think the following week, which will be in December. Actually, no, it won't be December yet. But it'll be close. It'll be the last week of, uh, this, of November. Guys, downsizing the resolution if I see 4K video. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if I'm going to do it. I'll see. Uh, I, I want to give people as many options as possible because I know there's some people that are out there that like watching. The problem is I'm street. I'm playing the game in 1440p. So um, one thing about Aberration, I will say, as hard as that map is, it isn't too hard on my system. It did, was at first, when I first launched the game, it was really really stuttery but then it smoothed out as it kept go as i kept playing so uh one thing i'll say about my um my system can handle it so far uh, and i'm hoping uh the other games will be good too and so far i think the island has been doing well but anyway uh i'm going to be streaming probably tuesdays and thursdays on youtube at seven o'clock between seven and nine, nine o'clock, or not nine o'clock, ten o'clock, uh, on uh, the weekdays. Uh, I'm also going to be dropping videos on the off days during the week. So, and then what else is going on? Uh, that's pretty much it. I've been, I got to be honest with you, there's a lot of stuff going on in my life right now. And don't be surprised if there is a missed stream from time to time. I got some Christmas shopping, which is going to be happening really late this year because of my budget issues. Um, we will be uh, probably either streaming in the evening one weekend uh, rather than in the morning. So I'm going to give you guys a, you'll get... I'm going to give you a heads up now, just in case, because I don't know. I'd like to hit the stores early, especially since I'm, I'm going to be doing some really late shopping. Um, I want to make sure I can get what I, I'm, I'm trying to get. And also, I want my mom won't go shopping with me, and I'm horrible with buying other people's stuff because I'm a selfish prick. <laughs> and... Um, no, I'm not. I just want to make sure I get the right things, and I want to. I want my mom there because she's really good at helping, uh, trying to figure out what to buy people. So I'm gonna probably have her along. I might actually ask my brother too to help me with, especially with his kids. Um, and that'll probably be it. Uh, but I think uh, leading into this, we won't be doing another 12-hour stream until the spring of 2025. Uh, we'll see though. I might do something on my birthday. Uh, I'm not sure what day that is. So I'll have to check. Actually, I should check right now. Just give me a second here. Uh, my birthday will be on a Sunday. So that will be, yeah, uh, maybe we might do something on the Sunday. I usually stream on Sunday, so that might be a thing we might do. So, um, not sure what we'll do, uh, but I figure we'll do something. Uh, I do want to expand the Twitch streams because I'm only doing two, two nights a week now. Uh, I'm hoping to expand them in the near future. Right now, it's not practical. It might be in, in January when we start going six hours rather than four. Uh, I want to turn this more into a part-time job uh, and you guys are helping a lot by just coming to watch my videos and watch my streams and enjoying the content. Hopefully you guys enjoy today because it's going to be fun. We got, we're in aberration. I'm right on a waterfall leading into the blue zone of, um, of the aberration map. And I actually saw where this place was by watching videos. And uh, so far, I've been actually pretty lucky with surviving. I mean, yesterday we had some issues with the uh, with uh, yieldings, but uh, at some point we're going to try to connect in game uh, with SD. SD will be managing our our uh, 
our base over in the other side of the green zone, which I believe is called the beach area of the green zone near the portal. Oops, nope, don't want to do that. Um, but uh, yeah, it's been uh, been having fun uh, playing on. I gotta be honest with you, there was times when I've been playing Aberration where I felt like it might I might give up because it was getting frustrating. And from what I hear, that's the norm. And from what I've been watching from even experienced players, yeah, uh, it's been rough. Uh, trying to find... By the way, my other uh, map is gone now. Uh, it, it expired, so... At some point, we're going to be having a Scorched Earth map. I'm going to hopefully, if I, ha if I can... Oh, why can't I? Content failed to load. What the fuck? Oh, what? I was having a lot of issues yesterday, and I'm, I apologize for being silent, but I'm trying to get into the game and it won't let me for some reason okay let's see i'm gonna get out of the game real quick it's not letting me into the game for some reason not sure what's going on not even let me oh i wonder if i have to do this How was I joining something that's... What the hell is going on with my game here? Ah! Okay, finally. There we go. Password. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. It's weird. Oh, where the hell am I? What? What am I doing here? What am I doing? Whoa. Oh my God. What the hell? This is... Okay, I'm confused. All right, here, let me show you what we're doing here. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, God. Stupid. This isn't my... This isn't the area... I saved at my base. I don't know why I'm up here. I got to figure out where I'm at. How far are we from? So the base is over. Oh my God. Did my guy die? And I just spawned in a random location? Oh, oh, that's not good. There we go. All right, we got to find, find a way to get back down. Try to avoid these mushrooms. I got all the stuff that I accumulated, but... Oh, God damn it. <laughs> Let's, uh...
So it turns out Oh my god. Gotta watch cause it's so dark here. I don't know why I was way up here. I made a base and hopefully it's still there. Okay, yeah, all right, I know where I'm at now. <laughs> okay, oh, god damn it. Well, we know where there's uh, Ovis, so we got, ooh, let's go grab this drop. That must have just showed up. I didn't see it when we were coming down. I don't remember dying or I'm not sure why it spawned me up there. It's weird. Oh, look at that. 64 green gems. Nothing really good, but I did get a... I got a, a ramshackle pike. Well, I will warn you that the computer is still pretty unstable. I'm... It ran fine for the server yesterday. Oh, God. Thank God I got a lot of food. I got a bunch of a animals tamed last night because I was doing some testing. And I figured, you know what? Let's finish building this house because I don't want people to see me gathering the whole time. We're going to try to do some taming. I'm going to have to get some more. I tried taming a doad last night and it... I it, I wasn't prepared for it, so. Oh, I it better not have messed up my tames because I actually had a baby a baby uh yeah Perry's there oh yep yeah, my baby uh needs care so let's take care of that I don't know why I I left the game inside my house So I built a little cabin here, and uh, actually, I wonder, give me a second here. I suck at the Discord thing, so just give me a second. I'm going to give uh, SD a call. And see if we could get him on the line. I just got to find the last... Uh I don't think I subscribed to his uh, server. But I think I could call him directly. Got to find his name. Don't call me directly. I'll just go to my server lobby. Gotta find your server. I don't think I actually subscribed to it. I apologize. I should probably. Uh, 
I suck at this Discord thing. I just don't get it. <laughs> I'm old. I wish it was a little more simple. Oh, yeah, it's GeForce. That's it. Uh... Oh, now I can't hear anything. Oh, wait, never mind. I might be in the wrong place. Uh, uh, maybe I'm in the wrong one. I'm in the GeForce uh, G layer. I don't see your actual name. Uh, let's see. Yes, go to the lobby. Okay. Okay, one second. Okay. Can't tell if anything's happening because I can't hear anything. Let me disable that. That might work. There we go. Yep, no problem. All right. Oh, yeah, and I got an otter. <laughs> so if you look over this waterfall here, and this is... Uh, Abert Trilobite. So we're going to set up a zip line as soon as we can. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Not now. Oh, every time. I'm stuck. Okay, I'm out. Good. We're going to set up a zip line to over there because apparently that's a good place to get s some resources. And also, apparently, nameless don't spawn in that area. So. So that's the blue zone. And that's where we want to go next as soon as we get the stuff we need. So right now I'm going to work on trying to get more metal and some flak armor. Just going to make sure I can see my... And you guys can join this server. You don't have to play with me. I'm gonna try to keep it running, but the problem is, is with our babies and stuff, it it's kind of hard. And I'm still kind of working on getting the the settings right. So, if you guys got any tips on how to the breeding, and not necessarily the breeding, but the oh god. Swimming well, there's an earthquake is not fun. The breeding times are the the basically the cuddle ti timers. I gotta learn how to work that a little bit better and try to incorporate it better into the server so that we're not waiting forever for teams to. Oh. Oh, let's put our plant species Z8. Oh my God, that's way too much. So right now our our taming is fast. Our 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 baby growth is fast, but the imprint the imprinting is very very slow. And I'm trying to get the right timing down for it. So you guys got suggestions. Everything, every place I go gives me different answers. And I'm having a hard time making sense of a lot of it. So there's like equations you got to do. 
and I hate math, so I want it told to me as simple and as simple as possible without making me feel like an idiot, which isn't easy, by the way. Oh, we don't want to be careful. There we go. There's some metal. I knew, I knew, I knew there was metal because that's right across from our building and I saw it up here. So I just wanted to make sure I knew where that was. Yeah, that's the thing. I mean, you want it fast, but you don't want to have it too fast so that you can't get the imprint. Oh, I'm too heavy now. Shit. Let's drop the stone. I should have, I should have emptied my, uh, should have emptied my stuff before. You got to watch out for these stupid mushrooms. So these round mushrooms that are on my seven slot, I, um, yes, it does burn longer than the wood. That's why I use spark powder. Uh, and if you could get angler gel, which we can't get until we get to the blue zone. Oh, fuck. I didn't know about angler gel until afterwards. Angler gel is the best uh, 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 thing to for your forges and stuff. So when I found that out, I took my berry or my um, basilosaurus and killed a whole bunch of angler fish. I got a tame angler fish though, because. I think we're going to need a lot of electronics. So getting silk pearls on the island is a lot easier than on this map. Um, at some point, we got to get cannon and and uh, tame a carcanos because apparently they're good at getting silk pearls. Best light source. Oh, I got to get a light pet too. Because if we're going to go into the blue zone, we're going to need one. So I'm going to try to tame a bulb dog. I did try, I did tame a bulb dog and he died. Because I got attacked by a raptor that was a 145. <laughs> bulb dogs are pretty easy to tame. And there's lots in this area. So uh, I'll show you where I'm at out of the map. I'll, I'll wait till I get to the ba base, though. So uh, as I said, the it was a sacrifice play. I killed myself and purposely spawned near this area because I knew this was a good place to uh, search for stuff. And this area is not bad, but there is some dangerous, like just getting here from the, so what I had to do was I had to, let me see, let's go on the regular map. I had to go from, stupid me, I should have spawned around here. But I, ac I actually spawned over here, so I had to go all the way across the lake to this little river here, follow this up, and then follow this river all the way to here. This is where the... This is a, a pretty good entry point to the... to the blue zone. And there's a lot of stuff we can get here. I actually, it. I had to do it anyway because I lost all my stuff, lost the Ravager. 
which kind of sucks. Oh, another imprint coming for our future meat gatherer. That's the doe ad I was trying to tame last night, and that didn't work out all that well. This is Vixen, named there after the rock band from the 80s. Go for a walk. Okay, I'm I'm happy with these choices. I was hoping to get I wanted to get a doe ad. Oh good. Didn't take long for that walk. I've lucked out with uh, drops in this area too. The drops seem to be pretty good for the most part. I got a purple drop that gave me this uh, ramshackle uh, pike. And then I got another drop that gave me these these uh, chitin gloves. So. Ravager got uh, I put this in here. Um, we need metal, so I am going to start forging metal. So you really do need, you you really need to get um, uh, metal. You need to get flak armor. Flak armor will keep you alive. Oh, by the way, the reason I put wood walls here is because I'm going to build extensions to this uh, house, mainly for storage. Oh, he's still following me. Jeez. Sorry, buddy. That node's still up there. I haven't, I don't think I destroyed that node yet. So let's go finish that one off. Let's get rid of all the shit that we're carrying first. Chasing a parasaur up the, into the base and then it changed its mind and came after me. <laughs> then I got. Another Arthropleura saddle. I've got a Parasaur saddle, which is uh, Journeyman. Oh no, that's, uh, yeah, Apprentice. I got Mastercraft Dire Bear saddle. These guys are, the Dire Bears aren't easy. You really need a long neck to get those guys. Oh, and um, so these mushrooms here, if you put them in, Here, you could actually brew, uh, you could actually make, um, they're actually good for using, uh, uh, making, um, geez, I can't speak today. Narcotics, that's it. Yeah, I'm looking for right now. Uh, we're going to start. I think I'm going to work towards getting a. Want to get a fabricator going. I should probably start killing some. Let's go kill some. Find some uh, oil. You know what? Let's get metal first. Actually, metal's probably more important. Actually, I'm not seeing that node up there now. It's still there. Let's go. There's sometimes a node that's... Yeah, I think I'm... Oh, there it is there. Okay. There's a node that spawns over here as well, but it, I actually took it out before I shut the server off last night. So I am going to, until I get those settings right, I think I'm going to avoid getting any babies. 
until after we get the settings set up right. It's mainly the killed him with the Carno. Oh, that's good. The Carno should be able to handle. I think the Carno is our highest leveled uh, creature. Yeah, unfortunately, the Ravager died to a Pyromane. <laughs> I was, uh, so I'll show you where I was so you could avoid it. Actually, the Pyromane's dead now, so we don't have to worry about it, but um, can't do it here. So let me go over to this side of the map. So I actually went into this area here. And a pyromane, actually, no, I think it was closer to our base. It may have been over, actually, no, it was over here. Uh, pyromane spawned right next to me and killed me immediately. And I tried a couple attempts without a mount. But then I thought, okay, Ravager should be able to handle a level 20 pyromane. Boy, was I mistaken. Holy crap. It wrecked. First, it killed me, and then it completely wrecked our uh, Ravager. God damn it! Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, okay, good. I hate those little things. This is the problem with having a lot of foliage. Oh, not bad. 75. Oh, and also this pick. I ended up getting a pick out of one of the drops, too. That's why the drops in this area are actually really good. Recommend. I I, I would stay where you were at, SD, though. And then once I get everything set up here, I would. We, you could probably come by. One thing I noticed, there's a lot of over raptors. Made the mistake of accidentally hitting one with my pike while I was fighting something, and they all attacked me. Oh, and uh, gas balls do shoot out of this. The only problem is you can't stay in there very long. I'm going to go see. Actually, maybe we'll take this metal back, and then we'll come back and... I'm gonna I'm pretty sure there's some nodes up there, but we gotta be careful because I Raptors like spawning up there. Also, there is a place to go in our area, I think, where you can get to the surface, but I'm not sure where it is. Or in the area where you're oh oh over raptor. All right. There's a drop over here. Try to get to oh no, that's up there. When I first got here, there was some problems with uh, yieldings. I haven't seen too many hardcore predators here. Raptors like to spawn in this area. They tend to attack everything that's in sight, and that's why I ended up getting a baby. And he's probably going to want care as soon as they get back here. Nope, not yet. Good. And there's that doad. I was, oh no, that's not the one. The one that I was trying is 120. I think he's back there somewhere. Some more spark powder. Okay, what else am I carrying that we could probably lighten up on? 
actually restore. I do have angler gel. What? Let's throw that in there and take that. It doesn't last like super long, but it. Oh, please be cuddle. Yeah. I could use the spark powder in our fire. Looks actually, I should probably check on this guy's food. How are you making out for food there, buddy? Oh, got none. All right. We're gonna have to go do some hunting. Parasaur's got a going to pump melee. We're not going to be using them for battle or anything. But I like melee really helps with the uh, We do need to make some more narcotics, so we might have to take them out for some uh harvesting so shortly. Oh, and apparently you do need I think it's blue gems. Um these blue gems apparently are needed for the glider suit. And that's going to be something we're going to need. Also, I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to make zip lines. I should have these bullets equipped just in case we get attacked. Throw that in there. This. Actually, this can go in here. Oh, let's see if we can get some blue gems again. I gotta say, this Krispy Kreme coffee I bought, it actually tastes pretty good. It's not very, very strong, but it tastes good. Ah, it's a long earthquake. Looks like it's nighttime on the surface, I think. Ten percent day. See, this is a good time to go up. Cause uh ninety percent night means it'll last a while. Oh, and there's a generator or a recharge station up there. Okay, our I'm wondering if I should take the Where's Wyan? Oh, <coughs> by the way, that's Y I Otter. I'm gonna take him with me. And I could use him as a backpack. Probably gonna need food soon. It was only a level one otter. Didn't take long to tame him. I'll just throw all the metal in him. Actually reduces our weight a little bit. The good news is there's a lot of creatures up here that could pretty much wreck wreck raptors but the problem is is these guys are pretty low level 
we've seen a few decent leveled stegos but well that one looks like it's stuck could be a candidate for taming might have to pick some mushrooms soon too Gotta watch for those mushrooms. I keep getting, I keep, every time I say that, I run right into them. This is where our bulb dog died and I died. This is the last time I died. 145 Raptor. Actually, I think it was a 95 Raptor, but there was a 145 with it. Looks like it's mostly pretty simple. But watch, as soon as I get over here, that's when they'll start spawning. Last time I was up this way, there was a yielding. And that's why I didn't come over here. Oh, there it is there. See, and there's metal over that way. That's why I wanted to go there. What level's that yielding? I don't even know what it's attacking. The Parasaur, maybe? The high level Parasaur. But because those guys are chicken shit. Oh, I'm. I'm just waiting to see if he comes after me. Looks like they're all attacking the... That thing's chasing the raptor. It's funny. Okay, that Pariser will probably wreck. Yeah, I don't know where that raptor went. I can't see him. I don't, I only have two of the species Z. I don't see the yielding. I don't, I wonder if they're like raptors, they won't attack big, bigger animals. It's up there. Apparently there's a technique to taming a yielding. It has something to do with grenades, but I'm not sure exactly what it is. I'm kind of nervous because if the yielding comes out, I don't want him following us back to our base, but it looks like he might be dead. There might be a body around here. Oh, we got some crystal over there. Don't really need crystal right now. Where is that metal node? There's a bunch of yieldings over there. Okay, we know not to go over there. Yeah, let's kind of stay away from that area. What the heck is that? I think there's a texture glitch there. Probably has to do with shadows. Go. 
God, that scared me. Forget there's no, uh, don't see the yieldings, but they could be clinging to the walls. There they are. Oh, God damn it. Problem is, is those mushrooms are everywhere in certain areas. Okay, I'm not seeing any metal here, so we'll have to wait till more spawns in. 140 bulb dog eight so what i might do is i have two seeds apparently when you have light pets nearby apparently they tend to uh sprout seeds more often I think aquatic mushrooms work on these guys too, but look how many, 32. Might be able to do it. Let's go see. Uh, I think we might have some aquatic mushrooms inside our parasaur. I had some on me, but they spoiled. They have a pretty stringent spoil timer. I see a blue drop. Let's see if we could get to it. I don't think these uh, these these drops have timers. ASD. Ooh, another Arthur Pleura saddle. <laughs> Man. I'm not sure how good they, those are for mounts. I think. I think what we might do is hit some river rocks, maybe get some metal that way. Yep. All right. Yeah, I'm only getting one metal per thing, but I got to wait till those metal things spawn back in. Oh, Vixen needs some care. Hopefully it's not some, oh good. So far I've been just getting cuddles and walks. That's actually not bad. All right, uh, let's put what metal we do have in here. Seventy pieces of metal. Okay, what do we need to make a fabricator? Oh, we need a shit ton of cementing paste. Actually.
20 cementing paste. That's not too bad. Uh, okay, let's go grab some rocks. Actually, we already have some fighting in here. <laughs> we only got one stone, though. All right, let's go get some stone. We'll gather up some more chitin. The good news is once you're high enough level, you could pretty much start from scratch and be able to get pretty much everything you need right off the top. If Oh, by the way, if you do decide to come to my area, there is a there's an explorer note right here. Okay, where'd that body go? Oh, it's like right next to my base. I actually haven't marked the base on the map yet. I should mark that. Put a waypoint down. One of the problems I've been experiencing is on my... On my... Um, single player games if i play single player in here i all my all my waypoints from the server show up it's kind of weird okay oh yeah it is for a uh, lake base oh no, that's my old base that's the one from my single player game i'm gonna yeah uh see let's go green I, there must be a way for everybody to see mm. oh yeah You'll see it on the, if you die, you'll see the bed. <laughs> Just don't use it. Otherwise you'll be all the way over here and your gear will be on the other side of the map. <laughs> Actually, the other side of the green zone. The green zone's pretty big. Like, all right. I put a waypoint down for the base. Um... I just showed the pings. I'm not sure that helps. Actually, these things give chitin. They're pretty much a one shot. Yeah. When I was trying to tame the the otter yesterday every time I killed a fish all the fish wouldn't attack me but they would surround me and I couldn't move <laughs> oh god damn it stupid turtle I needed the oil Gotten some black pearls from these guys, too. The good, the, the bad news is if I wanted to get a Ravager. Oh, by the way, they, they have their, if you see a vine, that's a natural zip line. You could use those. And you don't need yeah you could use those 
to go like go across to areas you can't get to yep mm -hmm. that might be uh i'm not sure don't quote me on it but that could be a place where you could go to uh that might lead you i i'm not sure where the entrance to the up, upper part is and apparently there's a lot of metal nodes in those areas and chitin you could get tons of keratin from the bones But a good chunk of the stuff that we really need is in the blue zone. And I don't think neither one of us are quite ready for that yet. But uh, that's why I wanted to go here because it's a good entry zone. And I think once we get, once we we have access to cryopods, we'll probably be able to, probably be able to, uh, start transferring a lot of our stuff we get a couple of good dinos to protect us ravagers seem to be the best dino to have in this area because they're so tanky and they could carry a lot mm -hmm. so what we'll do is Oh, I see. It looks like a stego. Oh, what's a trial by doing way over here? Oh, thank you. Yeah. But I'm wondering if that's why a lot of people consider Bird Owl Lake the best spawn because there's... There's a lot of ravagers around there, but once you get away from the lake, there's not as many. Like, I haven't seen any in this area. Mainly, um, where did that trial bike go? It lost its body. I'm going to have to get some. I wonder, do I have a torch on me? No, I don't. Thought I did, but I don't. Where did that body go? That stegosaurus is wrecking. I'm going to go get some free. Hopefully, I'll be able to get some free hide from a. a yep. Which I believe is a raptor that just attacked the stego. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> no you could breed them we you could get them still we once we what yeah once we have enough uh oh here's the body Spino would be a good team to have. I think a Pariser would probably be a good team mainly for transport. The only problem is I'm not sure what their melee... Because I have a Pariser saddle. Um, but I don't want to get a low level one. I have to get, uh, there's a lot around here. <laughs> there's a lot of herbivores. Yeah. Uh, I got like tons of doe ads. The only thing I'm not seeing, apparently the Ankies spawn mainly in the blue zone. And for the boss battle, we want Megalosaurus. Yeah. Uh, it's um, what's the guy the main guy that David Tennant plays? Yeah, he's a mutated version. 
He has a bunch of tentacles and stuff. You have to destroy all the tentacles, and as you destroy them, there's like, I think, four stages. He, he, he collapses, he collapses, and then you send your dinos in to start attacking them. Yeah, and megalosaurs are apparently the best because they they get a boost from, because this place is dark all the time. Yeah, they, I think it's sunlight that makes their, uh, makes them weaker, so... Yeah. Oh, 15. I have... I do have two plant species, Z. A 35, as long as I don't... He doesn't die, <laughs> I think I'll be okay. But I do want to get a light pet. Sea and berry. Oh, you must have sea and berries on you there, Perry, right? Yeah, there we go. Kind of weird that a raptor would want a sea and berry. Oh, did I grab the wrong Tinto berries? It's sea and berries that we we'll want. Uh there it is. What's that? <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, okay. Yeah. I don't... I I I don't know it either and I'm not even going to try. <laughs> it's just like chitin. I've heard people call it chitin. <laughs> For the longest time I've been watching Neebs gaming and when I first when they first start playing Ark they were calling it chitin. And then, but, but now they, now they call it chitin. They, they got something really cool going on on their arc stream. It's, I recommend checking it out because they have a guy that goes ahead into the, they, they, it goes ahead into the server and creates these towers. And it's really cool. So it's like almost like a little adventure in the game that they created for themselves. The thing is, it, it, yeah, I, I watch a lot of different guys. I like watching Flinger Foo. That's where I get a lot of my information on ARC. And uh, what's the other? Syntac? Neebs is funny. They, yeah, they're one of the funniest. They actually, on Conan Exiles, they have a whole bunch of stuff related to the Neebs gaming. They have uh, gravestones for each one of them. They have a tribute to the one of them that the guys that was part of the crew that died at in the in the yeah in the volcano they have a, a there's like a monument to him his name is thick forty four he used to be uh he played mainly um uh he used to play call of duty and I think they started. Um, Neebs Gaming playing Call of Duty and they called it Call of Duty Friends and they animated their their uh, exploits in the game it's actually quite a, quite funny to watch and then they, they just started playing 
their characters in, in each game that they play, and it's... They're out of... I think they're from Wilmington, North Carolina. Yeah. Yeah. And they're, they try to base a lot of their characters... Uh, they use, usually use basically the same skin for each character that they play in games. They don't play Ark very often, but I think they actually have been enjoying Ark. They didn't like it because of how hard Neebs gaming. Yeah, they're playing Ark right now. They play well, they have a Conan Exiles. Oh I got a Yeah. They play a lot of survival games. Uh, I think today they got a Elder Elder Elden Ring there I don't say like 80 bucks I'd like to play Elden Ring but I can't afford it right now oh there's more than two I thought there was only two Oh, thank God I took those guys out. I think that I think the otter was actually attacking. <laughs> Where'd the other Oh, you must have ate that that other raptor must have ate the body of the raptor I killed. Oh god damn it every time I really hate those mushrooms If you're not paying attention you're screwed in this game <laughs> Especially if you're low level Oh I'm going to try get this I can't see it Oh Valheim I have Valheim it, It's not oh I died <laughs> from the mushrooms I died from the mushrooms <laughs> hey, I, you know what I think it would be good with multiplayer I find it really boring while playing, sing playing solo like with ARK you could play solo and still have fun uh, I find I don't know if it's the music and it there's a learning curve because it's a lot different than other survival games. Yeah. Yeah, you do have to fight. Yeah, you do have to fight. Yeah, it's a, basically a Viking game. You start out, you're basically in between Valhalla and like you're in like kind of a purgatory between. Yeah. Uh, one game that I was getting into and I might start playing again after I'm done the island on YouTube I'm gonna, gonna plug 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 um, once I'm done the island I might start playing Soul Mask again that was a fun game I actually enjoyed it another one that has a pretty steep learning curve and it's shrouded it's pretty good too Yeah, I think it, going into that gas geyser and then getting hit by those mushrooms killed me. Where's why I otter? Oh God, I have him on wander, son of a bitch. No, I don't want to pull anything. Why did I do that? put my armor back on because it shouldn't have gotten damaged because I oh I guess I got to repair it anyway oh god I'm gonna have to figure out what's this neat chitin fiber and hide oh and I got level
Oh, I came to, I don't know why I came up here, because I was trying to get a bulk, bulb dog, and I'm an idiot. Actually, let's put these seeds. I, originally, I was going to keep the seeds to plant them. But I'll hold on to them until I'll, I'll use them to tame because we'll probably be able to get more anyway. Yeah, recommend Neebs Gaming. It's entertaining. It's really fun to watch them. They also play Seven Days to Die. That's that seems to be their favorite game because all of them like it. <laughs> Yep. Yeah, if I if I if I do play that, it'll probably be mainly on recordings and I'll just play a day at a time. Yeah. Kick. Mhm. Mm Mm -hmm. oh wow it said three and only took two interesting okay this one oh it's a okay this one's gonna i've been naming all the bulb dogs after my real life dogs that i've had so I'm gonna name this one because it's a female. Misty. Oh, and I can't pick him up. Son of a bitch. <laughs> okay, otter. Why I otter? Was that? Hmm. Yeah, we uh, I had a Sheltie, purebred Sheltie with three legs. That's why I was able, I wouldn't be able to afford a purebred Sheltie, but I got that one for free because they were going to destroy it. And that dog, the irony is the dog lasted longer than the rest of the litter. Yeah. Had it for 15 years. Best best dog we've ever had. You could leave the gate open, would never leave. Walk right next to you, doesn't didn't run off. <laughs> so from what I've heard, otters when you put them on on wander. They'll go and gather, but I'm wondering if the problem with this otter is I don't have it on, maybe I don't have the gathering options turned on. I'm not sure exactly how to turn them on though. It's gonna leave them here. Where's my bulb dog? Hey, Misty. Get up here. Actually, before we do that, I should put some food in you. And let's turn on your light. There you go. You're worried about light in the cabins? Get yourself a light pet. Lights up the entire room. <laughs> the only thing is you have to charge it after a certain amount of time. Any gems fall? A short earthquake? Oh, it must be nighttime outside because it's pretty dark in here. 
I don't want to get into too much trouble with this guy because he's low level. Oh, looks like the metal spawned across the lake here. Or the river. Oh, and I got to make... I need to make some arrows to turn into zip line anchors oh it's so nice having metal right across from your base it's unfortunate it's just one one node started off with 23 angler gel and it's only down it only went down about a half and it did almost all my metal oh yeah that's what i wanted i have to get some chitin make some cementing paste Oh, and apparently in that lake where I set up the base there, occasionally otters are supposed to be spawning in there. Although, like I said, otters, I don't know how effective they would be on this map. Oh, there's a baby bulb dog here. I don't want to hit it. I want to get the... Those bulb dogs could actually bite quite a bit. There's the adult. Yeah, this I went and bought this Krispy Kreme coffee. It actually tastes pretty good. The only thing is, is it's light roast. Usually get medium. That's probably why it's not that strong of a... There was a 75 yielding over here. I haven't been this way in a long time. It was clinging to a wall, but I haven't seen it lately. Oh, do we go try to explore over there? Uh, maybe we'll leave the light pep behind. I want them to die. Get some stone. These stupid fish, they get in your way. You can't move. Are you following me? I don't think so. All right.
Well, I think I got enough cementing paste. Crystal. Should have crystal. If not, I know where we can get some. Oh, we might be short on the crystal. Spark powder. Ah, perfect. We got ourselves a fabricator. Now I just have to make some oh, some gasoline to power it. And then I'm going to see if windmills will work here. Because windmills are a lot cheaper than using gasoline to power everything. Oh. <laughs> Was that an attempted tame? Did he just pop out of nowhere or something? I have this... For some reason, they just seem to spawn right on top of you sometimes. It's weird. All right. Got a fabricator. Let's find a place to put it. I might have to build a platform for this. All right, let's get some gasoline going. Pretty sure I have oil in here. Start moving all the stuff that can go in the fabricator. Did you have to kill it? Mm -hmm. Our, our um, raptor that we have back at the base, is that a male or female? Oh, okay. Cause I, got a, I, got a, I got a female here that's still growing. Okay. Oh, there we go. We got a breeding pair right now. If I have to wait till this one, it's a level 100, so... What's its mute? Inherit oxygen mutable. That's a horrible trait. <laughs> uh, oh, I want the gasoline in here. Okay, let's see what we can make with this thing. All right. Uh, was it electrical? No. 
Although a fridge would probably come in handy. But we're... We don't have enough stuff for that yet. Uh... So this is what we need for the red zone, the hazard suit. You need 25 blue gems, 45 congealed gas balls, 50 crystal, 45 hide, 65 fiber, and 25 polymer. That's just for the the shirt <laughs> uh, attachments zipline motor I think we need that oh that's expensive too okay hazard metal where do you make the trying to find the wingsuit but I can't remember what they call it because we're going to need those gas collector that's something I could use Glider suit, that's it. Crafted in the smithy, okay. 25 blue gems. 100 fiber. It's not that expensive. 60 metal ingots. Oh, man, you... How do you get... How do you get a Karkonos when you can't make the saddle because... If you don't have access to blue gems right away, how many blue gems do we have? Do I have here? I got 14. That's nowhere near what we need for anything. Okay. Um, now that we got this built, we should probably start working on getting stuff that we can make with it. Uh, structures, electric. Steam lights and lamps. Ooh. I guess that's steampunk themed lights and lamps. Um, structures. Electric. Electrical. Cementing. 20 cementing paste, 75 metal ingots, and 25 electronics. Okay, how much? What do we got to make? For electronics, we need metal. Okay. Oh, it's going to be rough because we got to wait till the metal spawns back in. Otherwise, ah, I wonder maybe making the zip line. You don't necessarily need the motor. I can make zip lines right now. Okay, let's get some flint and some. S I think I have wood somewhere. Did that spawn back up there? It looks like that metal is back in there. We'll have to go get it later.
craft some Oh, it's thatch we needed. There we go. There we go, we got four. I think you gotta use two per, uh... okay. Let's hope I don't screw this up. <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can make a thing going into the blue zone. I'm not sure how these work. Never used them before, so. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it sucks. Cause I thought maybe I've seen, maybe I just have to find a better place to go. But I don't know how to reverse it. And I, I think I'm stuck here now. Like, uh, get, oh God, we don't want to go that way. What? No, I mean, I don't know how to uh, 
pull it out of the ground after you used one side of it. I think there's a way to do it. No, I think uh, once I've shot, I think I just wasted one of them. Oh, well. I got to figure it out. I think there's a way to do it where you could... I wonder if doing it off this log, but I don't know if I could get back up. You know what? Maybe putting some foundations down and building out might be a good idea. I don't know if we could build here, though. I'll have to find out. Oh. Oh, no. Fell into a rat hole. Oh no, Misty! I just threw her into the blue zone. I gotta... Well... I'm going to have to kill myself. <laughs> Figuratively. Well, literally in the game. I hate when you get stuck in those stupid things. There's a light bug in our in my base here. <laughs> Wants to go for a walk. Okay. I think I might have lost Misty. Oh, good. Forty three percent imprint fifty. Yeah, that's way off. I'm not going to get a full imprint on it. Okay, Misty didn't fall to her death. That's good. Like, I get all my shit back, and I can't get to that spot where I fell. Uh, looks like my stuff might be lost. Well, that kind of sucks. Oh, I'm going to get stuck in there again. Oh, that sucks. Oh, you're watching their videos? Mm -hmm. And they, they, it's like a mini platform game in there. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, though they have a guy go in there and do it ahead of time. Like one of their editors. Yeah, they they make a lot of money. They just had an event for uh, 
like they were invited by the guys that developed uh, Dead by Daylight, or not Dead by Daylight, uh, Seven Days to Die. And they they just did, um, they have a new game called Blood Moon, which is kind of like their version of uh, Battle Royale. And they they debuted it with, I don't think it's out, but they kind of let Neves kind of show show what the game's going to look like and everything. Apparently they did it on a live stream, on probably on Twitch. I didn't see it. I didn't see it on any of their videos, but they have a... They were just talking about it this weekend. Okay, well, all the stuff that I just did is kind of screwed now because I got a... I lost all my stuff. Damn it. Okay, I have a stone... Where is my... I don't know where my stone stuff... Where did I put them? I, I When I first spawned back in here, I had a stone pick and stone axe, and now I can't find them. No, I think it might have been in... I might have not taken them out of my inventory initially, so it looks like I got to start from scratch again. Son of a bitch! <laughs> That's okay. Well, it won't take long. I have to get a bunch of metal. Of course, none of the rocks here are ones that you can... Oh, there we go. Yeah, they uh, they had a contest with all four members of the team where they, they had a horde night every night and they had to build bases to... And, <laughs> and the, whoever... Whoever survived the horde night. Ooh, there's a Eck was stuck in a rock here. So whoever whoever survived like whoever the last person was, the other three were put on a billboard in their hometown saying that we're losers. Yeah, in Wilmington. Yeah. <laughs> Two of them, I think, are from North Carolina. The other one, Simon, is from New York. He has a thick New York accent. And, uh, and Dora, he, he's from Minnesota. Oh, that, that horse got out. Oh, that's a juvenile horse. The mother is still alive somewhere. Because the juvenile horse. There's the. Oh, God damn it. I didn't do anything. I was just looking at your baby. Now he's attacking me. Okay, do we have enough to make a pick? It's all we need is a pick, because I just have to go get some metal. I think I'm going to start working on getting... I'm going to try to make some... Um... I might make uh, flak armor. 
because I think it's necessary for this map. <laughs> it's going to take a while because we don't have a lot of metal to work with. What else did Neebs Like, I've watched a lot of... I actually got into them from watching their Conan stuff initially. And then they stopped playing Conan for a while, and then they got into Ark. But it seems to be de Seven Days to Die. They have some pretty funny... GTA videos. Oh, God damn it. Every single time. I am going to leave my light pet here. Just want enough metal to make a metal pick. So Flinger Foo is the person I watch mostly for my art content, right? I was watching his Aberration videos last night. He does soloing the arc on Aberration. And he, um, he started in the same area we're in, like where you're at right now. And he actually, oh, God damn it, every time. Yay, I got a seed. Where is it? There it is. Come back and get more later. I just want to get, get this metal processed. I was kind of hoping to start making some plots so I could start growing some of these flowers so we could get more seeds out of them. Hello, Mr. Ovis. You know what? I was thinking, oh, we can't do it just yet, but we may have to make a spear so I can kill that Ovis. Get some hide. Oh, it's break time. I'm going to take a break. I'm going to go back to base and take a break. We actually have metal being made right now. Okay, we're going to have to make sure uh, 
that we stay clear of that side. I'm going to probably build something that we could, like a platform or something. Okay, weapons, melee, pick, axe, scythe. All right, we got all our weapons back. I'm going to take a quick break. I'll be right back. Just going to go grab some coffee.
Hey guys, back. Okay, so we got all of our stuff back. Now we just gotta make our armor again. I think we might have enough stuff to make a full set of leather armor. Let's see. Actually, before we do that, let's see what we need to make the... Ooh! 23 metal ingots. Oh, that's all we have is 23 metal ingots. Okay, we'll make leather armor for now. And then we'll... Or hide armor. And then we'll work on getting the flak next. It was probably good that that happened to me. go do a little bit of hunting just to get some food oh I just realized we don't got we do need chitin but this also gives us some meat to grab all the crystal that we have I may have used it all up son of a bitch oh looks like we're gonna have to go get some crystal are you ribbing me now you want cooked prime meat sure how we're gonna do that i don't think there's anything here does parasaurs give prime meat i guess if we could find a baby any babies that we could easily kill Twenty is a little bit too too rough. That's an over over raptor. Like even a baby parasaur would probably be good. That's too many close together. 125 and 110. Nope. That'll probably kill me. I just need one piece of prime meat so I can cook it. Shit. Let's gather the crystal we need.
Man, these red mushrooms are everywhere. Thank God I didn't. I shouldn't say anything because watch, I'll walk right into one. Okay. Are those. I think something took out those raptors. Nope. Nope. There they are. We'll try to head in the opposite direction of the raptors. Get this out just in case. Not sure what level it is. Oh, I don't have any food. I'm gonna have to kill that spino. Wait. Come here. What are you attacking? Oh. <laughs> What's up? Spino coming after the me and the Carno. Oh no. I'm trying to get away. What level Spino? 115. Oof. Okay, that would be rough. If it, if it was a lower level, you might survive it with the Carno. Oh, you stupid. Trying to avoid, trying to avoid some, uh, went into the trap and that's uh got me protected from him that trap has saved my life several times oh yeah yeah he can't get me i might actually be able to um hang on a sec okay aquatic yeah. mushrooms help with who don't help with food but it does help with water uh let's see these Okay, that did Dude, that did stop help. trying. Okay. 130, 117. Son of a bitch. Why can't I find any good babies that I could easily kill? Okay, we're gonna have to miss that imprint. Because I can't find anything that I could use. We do need to get more food though, so I have to find something to kill. Mr. Trilobite. gems we need oh that looked like it hit me in the head <laughs> Stuff yeah, picked up for it. Disappears. The other way. Yeah, he ran. Oh. Yeah, I think he's still hanging out by the trap. Yeah. I'm going to try to. Gonna cook the food that I have. So that oh I don't. God. He is coming right back for me. Uh... 
I'm trying to get him into the trap. What, the spinal? Yeah, I don't know if he can get in, though. He's pretty big, so it might yeah. not be that easy. Okay, why can't I hit you? I hate those trial bites. Sometimes they get glitched into the ground. You can't hit them. Level 20 Parasaur. I don't trust that I can't can take it down. It'd probably kill me. Let's cook up this meat. You know what? The problem is I'm gonna have to turn this guy to oops. I don't want to kill any of my teams, but this thing's right, right on my base, and he might be a source of prime meat. My parasaur die? Yep. Why I, your otter died? Oh. Oh, cause my otter was on a. Oh, okay, never and mind. He just died. Yep. Son of a bitch. <laughs> By a parasaur. Oh. Yeah. Oh, was... that's what you were trying to get. Oh, okay. I thought I I thought you said parasaur. Okay. Hopefully, okay, they calmed down enough that I could get my stuff. And there's my otter. Oh, look at that. That's the second light pet that I've had that died. Oh well, need to hide. Let's gather. I need a prime meat, but I don't know anything in here that gives me prime meat. Uh, yeah, that's why I figure he was level 20, but even a level 20 could hit pretty hard. Alright, let's uh, put our armor back on. Yeah, I'm not going to bother with that. I think the imprint's pretty much done because I can't get... There's no way I could get cooked prime meat right now. Had I had like a shotgun or something... I could work on that, but it's going to take time because... Well, did the angle Joe ran out? Yeah, it did. Wow. Make a spyglass. Take a sip of my coffee. I got so many green gems. Okay, what do we need? No. Electronics. So we need more metal. Well, I have a pick now. 
I can find metal and we should be able to harvest it pretty easily. We just got to wait for it to spawn back in. more cementing paste going I really need that for the windmill if I can build one I think the metal nodes have spawned back in oh vixen ran away he's in the water thank god he didn't go and attack Okay, why do you... I don't know the pathing of these creatures. It's so stupid sometimes. They have a direct way of getting to me. And it takes the most indirect way. There we go. Alright. Oh, let's uh, do that. There we go. I'm sorry, I can't give me cooked prime meat. I just don't have anything that I can kill this parasaur with right now. Are you streaming, uh, ST? No. No? Okay, cool. This. Yeah, in December, I'm probably going to have to stream in the evenings on the weekends for a couple of, day, a couple of weeks because I got to do some Christmas shopping. And I'm probably going to do it in the morning to avoid the real crazy rushes. Every year I say, oh. I'm just gonna go I'm gonna go do my Christmas shopping early and I never do I might kill that Ovis there's a level 70 bulb dog why don't I get on my five species dead if we get a couple it said five last time and i i only used two and it's tamed yeah okay, i'm watching where i step Six species dead. Ooh, fires will be handy to make. What was that? Fires. Fires, yeah. Apparently, they're good for repairing your armor. I think it uses less resources. 
yeah, you definitely need a light pet for these things to spawn. Okay. Uh, let's pick some mushrooms. That's a female, 140 female. Oh no, that's a parasaur. The rap no, the raptor's a 45 female. Okay. Let me see if I can get her. She's chasing a, a parasaur right now. Chasing him right toward a spino. Try to get some more of these aquatic mushrooms. I got her. <laughs> Ooh, Spino? What level? No, the raptor. Oh, raptor. Like I said, you could always breed up. Shit. Depending on its, depending on its, uh, I'm wondering if these stats that we're the getting on the, the stats that we're getting on these, um, spy glasses might be a little off. Because it seems like it's taking less than what it actually says. Got her. Stuck with a female, but that's okay. We need to meet that. Okay, this one definitely gonna take a little longer. Oh god damn it. <laughs> Figures. I gotta go find that bald dog. Thank God there's a lot of mushrooms here. These guys are pretty easy to tame. Just gotta be very patient. Yeah. Just gotta wait till they're. Oops, almost knocked my headset off. Just gotta wait until they're hungry, and it seems like, from what I've heard, when it was unevolved, you had to wait forever to for their uh, ready to eat prompt. Yeah, my guess is it'd be good because they'd be running a lot. Actually, I can see what it does. Hang on. Mm -hmm. uh, we should probably look at making that. Uh, I think it's not that expensive. They have a. 
what's it called the gen genetic uh, I forget what it's called <laughs> I think you could make it in the fabricator I'll have to look just give me a sec 12 dogs almost ready about 73 percent You basically inject your, uh, and you could take the traits off too, if you want. So if it's a bad trait, you could take it out. And then you could transfer traits into the babies. See, there's a source of prime meat right there, and unfortunately, if I tried to attack it, Mama Mama Stego would probably kill me. You just pooped. You should be able to eat. Come on. Ninety five percent. Yeah, I think the some tells me that the spyglass is good for some stuff, but it's not accurate right now and it ha might have something to do with aberration having that analyzer okay i'm not sure what we're gonna call this one uh fancy There we go. This one's higher level, so it might be better. Okay, let's go see if there's any... Um... Actually, let's turn on... Light. Give it some food. Ooh, I got biotoxin somehow. You can make really good darts out of that. Yeah, I only got one. <laughs> I'm not sure from what though. Metal did spawn back in. That's good. So, yeah, when you have your, uh, the bulb dogs, you could actually use them like a pack pack. You could put stuff in there and it takes your encumbrance away. Yeah, but then you gotta put their weight up. I think they're pretty good as long as you don't have them following you. You just have them on your shoulder. Okay, there must be another node here. Oh, walking on the edge like the oh god damn it. <laughs> By the way, that little gurgling noise where it sounds like you're drowning, that's supposed to be you throwing up, from what I've heard.
Okay, let's go take this metal back. Oh god, again. I did it again. Every single time. get some more of these good mushrooms that help heal us not stuck in the they sometimes have some of the textures overlap that's kind of annoying because you can't pick when a mushroom's too close to a rock you can't pick it Okay, at the risk of losing my shoulder pad again, I am going to go attempt to see if we can find some more metal over this way. Not seeing any predators nearby. They may have been taken out by these high level stegos. And then we have to get some hide, which I don't think will be a problem. There's plenty of ovus around here that we can easily take out. Just trying to keep an eye out just in case those yearlings got a little closer. Is there a baby dodo with these guys? That would have given me some prime meat that we could have fed. Iguanodon. I thought was initially I thought maybe it was a raptor. Not seeing the yieldings flying around right now, so maybe we might be safe. But they could be clinging to a wall until something pops up. Or they're out of render resistance. Nope, they're out of render. I think they're out of render. I can't see anything shooting. That's the one thing that we're probably going to have the hardest time avoiding is those yieldings. They suck. Oh, there's one right on the roof there. I think that's a yieling. Oh, God damn it. There's one. I don't think he saw me. I hope he didn't see me. He was pretty close. Oh, blue drop. What do you got for me? Gilly chest piece. Oh, that might not be a bad thing to have. Ramshackle. Yo, I might have to check to see. I was thinking maybe making one of those cliff platforms and putting that on that ledge. 
and then building some pla some uh, ceilings out from that might put us in enough distance so we could shoot to get closer to that ledge. Either way, we do have access to the blue zone in this area, which is something we need to do once we have the equipment. Fortunately, because of the limited amount of metal that's available in this area, I was thinking too, if you have a bunch of raptors, they get a really good bonus for mate boosted. You go for a hunt, you'd probably get tons of hide and meat. <laughs> I wonder if they went after like a Ovis how much how much uh button they would get. Oh I should probably look into making a trough over here. I don't think this biotoxin is going to last long. I think it must have, I must have got it from the otter. what i think you get biotoxin from some of the mushrooms Giganta raptors are good at collecting babies, by the way. If you're if we ever get one tamed. I have to get some food. Got one I've never one yeah, you basically gotta go uh you gotta get some ghillie armor, sneak into the nest, and once you you get crouched into the nest, the baby comes to you and you have to play a little mini game. And after a certain amount of time, after you do it a few times, it'll slowly tame. You're talking about the chickens? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, they're th really? those big. Yeah, oh, those. Oh, you get them as babies. Okay, yeah. you don't get a big one. Okay. Yep. All right. So how do you deal with the adults? You just hide in the in the, the thing, oh. and yeah, what you oh. do is you know what you get egg. <laughs> yeah, but you the way you distract them is they eat eggs. So you just leave the eggs out away from the nest. Oh, 
the, the adult, okay. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense, because you, like, okay, draw them away. Yeah, that... You know what? I'm not going to take the bulb dog with me. I'm going to leave it behind at the base. I'm going to go explore in another area. See if I can find some more metal. I'm done taming that raptor. I'm back going back to what I was doing. Oh, I got to get food for this raptor. Get back here, you little shit. God damn it, these guys are fast. Now I got two of them on the run. Oh, Vixen died. Son of a bitch, I was trying to get food for it. Monster. How did it die? Starved. Oh, oh, it's just... Um, well, I can make babies. Apparently, the, the female's ready to mate. <laughs> cool. We could make a pack. Yeah, yeah, a pack of, uh, where's that baby? Now uh, I got, now, now I got prime meat. <laughs> you gotta get the, the imprinting fixed before we do any breeding. Yeah, yeah. You really gotta fix that. I don't know why you didn't do that. I still don't even know how to do it. So, you want like, me to look it up? I everything I've looked up gives me different you answers. You want me to look it up? I can look it up right now for you. Sure. I've done it before. Sure. Okay. okay. Why am I still carrying my? I better put this away just in case I lose all my stuff again. Yeah, every time I've looked up, I keep getting different answers for it. That's why it, it was kind of frustrating. That's because the imprinting is, you, you've already changed mm -hmm. settings that are going to affect the imprinting. Mm -hmm. You did something with the breeding, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Nope. I haven't nope. changed that. It was just the imprinting and uh, and uh, not the taming. Okay. It's the okay. baby raising, the the maturity level. Yeah, I've increased the maturity speed, but it tells me to do it like it, it, there's like some kind of fraction to do it. So smaller creatures usually grow faster, but the larger ones don't grow as quickly. So like a raptor will probably take about an hour to tame. Not tame, but uh, to uh, grow. Or maybe about an hour and a half. And then, but the problem is, is I can't figure out the imprint speed. Like how to do that. They give me some kind of fraction, wait, but. Wait. Did that Ravager took like a, didn't that Ravager take like a day to, to grow? Mm -hmm. Yep. But yeah, but that's before I fixed that. Oh, that so you speed. did fix that. Okay. Yeah. I fixed the, the amount, the time it takes for it to grow. It's just the imprint. Yeah. Yeah, there's some more. Let's see if I can get some more. Oh, I forgot. I got to make a crossbow still. Son of a bitch. Yeah. That's all you gotta do. Yeah, but the problem is, is they don't tell you what you need to put that at in order. That's what I have it. Right that's now. what I have it on. So it's off. I don't know why it doesn't work. It makes Hang no on. sense to me. <laughs> uh, what was I? Oh, I was gonna make. Um. I completely forgot what I was doing here. Oh, crossbow. Have you looked at this Reddit post before? 
I, I've all, looked like stats for everything, not just mm -hmm. interval multiplier. So yeah. this might fix it for you if you looked at this. There we go. Got a crossbow. Actually, let's grab those arrows. Make some get yeah. some tranks going. I'm copy this into ah! Son of a bitch. God damn it. Uh, just put it in a message on uh, Discord. I'll uh, I check you it. Don't know how to read those no, I can. I, I I just have to. I don't know where to find stuff. That's all. I'm... It's all on the left side, Bugsy. Mm -hmm. well, everything's on the left side of the Discord box. You can see everything there. Messages, servers. Mm -hmm. It's very simple. Mm -hmm. There's nothing complicated about it. Mm -hmm. And just having time to actually go through everything. Go when I set it up, I accidentally, I accidentally set up another thing because I couldn't find my own. <laughs> okay, where did my there. stuff that was in there go? Uh, okay. Just a one. Okay, yep. well, I gave you those settings in the in um mm -hmm. message. Yep. In I'll, yeah, I'll check it. Check it out when I'm done here. Yeah, yeah, I don't you don't have to do it right now if you've got an hour left. Yeah, well we yeah, I don't want yeah, I don't wanna shut off the server while no. we're in the middle. No. Especially since thing, things seem to be going with the exception of me getting stuck in a rat hole. Um, things seem to be going pretty good today. Only died, what, twice? <laughs> this is the first time in a while that I haven't been in a death loop. Okay, gotta get some more meat to make some spoiled meat. Okay, I'm gonna leave my bulb dog here. Grab some food for it. So it doesn't starve to death. Seems to like those aquatic mushrooms. The one thing that will probably take a while to to get fully imprinted are the larger creatures. I don't think there's much we can do about that. Not if you use the settings I just gave you in the message. Yeah? Okay. Yes. You got a level again. Alright. Alright. You guys are safe here. We've been pretty good. There hasn't been anything spawning in that's dangerous. I am going to go explore over this way. See if I can find some metal. While the other spawns. And I got to watch because there was a yielding over here. Have you had any issues with not being able to go into uh, into the bo like storage boxes and stuff? No, I haven't had any issues. I think it's just my game because I yesterday while I was playing I couldn't access anything. And then I got locked in the house one time because I couldn't get in to, um, check it for yieldings. I had a issue, uh, trying to get into, um, 
I'm, like the doors were all locked or weren't locked, but I couldn't open them. <laughs> so my, I think. Like a server issue. No, I don't think it was a server issue because if. Well, it may have been. Everything seems to be fine today, but I've had that issue pop up a couple of times. And I think it was while you were on. Oh, so me. Okay. no 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 okay. no it's just uh while you while you were on you were able to do stuff and i wasn't that was weird i'm just playing the game yeah so i think it might be just my game i might have to maybe verify my uh look at this thing looks like there's two spawned in at the same time Oh, and I just remembered I forgot to bring There's a raptor taking on a turtle in the water Seems to be having a little bit of difficulty I think the turtle actually beat the <laughs> nice. Oh, missed. I'm actually surprised. This is kind of a swamp area, and there's no snakes or anything. <laughs> well, let's see, YOLO. Can I get out? Where am I heading? Die. Oh no, I'm dead. I'm dead. Carol died. Sorry about that. <laughs> was that the. Uh, Damn. Was that Carl the Carno? That's happened to me a lot. That's how I lost the Ravager. Yeah, because there's two hiding oh. somewhere else. All I saw were the two. Feelings. I hate those things. I got to figure out how to tame one. I'm going to go that way because that is feather in my ass. Don't want that. So far, it seems like the main predator in this area is raptors. I haven't seen anything bigger than that. So that's reassuring. And a lot of low level. Well, my guess is this is probably one of the lower area spawn points, maybe. It's kind of funny because the Fertile Lake is dangerous. Like, it's infested with spinos. And surrounding it are ravagers and raptors. And yet, it's considered easy. <laughs> then again, the portal is supposed to be the easiest spot to spawn it in is. in the map. It but, is. I tried it. It's a lot easier. All there are, there's only... Um, uh, herbivores that's it okay. well no 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 there's also if you're not careful if you're if you depending on where you spawn ooh, an egg kind right of egg spawn point. yeah It'll there's there. there's um I pick up this egg i'm gonna get attacked by a parasaur but that's okay i could probably take a parasaur 
You're trailing off. What were you getting attacked by there? Who? Me? You. Yes. Nothing? In the main area, in the first area, in the easy area. You said oh. you were getting attacked oh, by Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, yeah, I got attacked by... There was a lot of... Um, uh, what do you call it? The... The big snake things. Uh, basilisks. Yeah, basilisks. They... they there, the there's a lot, ones. there's a lot in, there's a lot in that area, so. Oh, I wow. See when I was playing, so. Yeah, when I first spawned in, there was one on each side. Wow, no, I didn't have yeah. that issue. I yeah. started making a base and everything in that area on another game. And Actually, on like I said, too. where, 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 where we, where I set up my base I didn't even know this, but that's basically where, um, like I said, Flinger Fu. He set up his actually set up a camp right next to the. There's a plant. In the corner near where our base is. One of those uh, plant species Z. Yeah, I saw it. Yeah, he. Uh, ooh, we got we got metal. Yeah, he set up over there and. He has like a. He just put like a couple of foundations down and put his smithy and. I'm not the type of person to just put a couple of things down. If I'm going to build a base, especially if it's just like an outpost base or a starter base, might as well go all out, right? Especially in that, especially on this map with Ravagers and stuff all around. Well, it wasn't really completed here. Yeah. Things are still able to get into the base. Yep. Things are still able to get into the base, so it's nowhere near done. That's yep. what I'm trying to finish. Yeah. I'm going to put a wall up of, over here. But like I said, so far, I haven't had any issues over in this area. There was a couple of yeelings, but they came in from another area. They got, I guess they chased something here. But I was able to lead them off and they, nothing's spawned in since, so. Wow, that. Oh, that's probably because I haven't put it in there. Oh, my pulp dog was following me. Ah, let's pick you up. Not make that mistake again. Ooh, green drop. We'll get that. Let's hope that we get a good drop here. Some of them have been good. Some of them have been eh. Actually, I think one of the issues I had yesterday was my internet connection. My internet was kind of acting funny. After I logged off, I went to go watch some videos and they were loading really slow. Then I turned my VPN on and it started working. Weird. All right, uh, let's put that in there. Hmm. Not sure if we're going to use any of this stuff, but it might come in handy when I start exploring in the blue zone. Probably going to need them for uh, building a little place for the bed and everything.
Okay, how are we doing for transports? What's that? Oh, the train stuff. Okay. <laughs> oh, that, that, if we ever decided to do the train thing, that, that probably, we could probably do a train all the way from where you were at to here, but it would probably be a pain in the ass to build and probably very expensive. I think that was meant for more PvE type stuff. Okay. Or, I mean PvP. Or role playing. That's what it meant. You know what? Let's make chest plate pants. Gauntlets. We just need to make boots and a helmet. All right. I'm feeling more protected now. If you ever decided you wanted to come over here and work with me, I have some armor. I'll, I'll, I'll try to make some stuff for you here so you could teleport with the beds or something. But ideally, I'd like to try to find a way where we can meet each other halfway and work together to get back here. At some point, this is probably going to be our main base. Okay, let's go see if that other spawn point... No, it doesn't look like that metal spawned back up there yet. Well, maybe. Let's go check. A lot of fish here. Probably should just start killing fish here but I've got all my gear back, so I'm good. so far a lot of the stuff here is pretty high level too there's only been a handful of low level stuff right and actually let's keep this out just in case we get attacked by something Giant bee honey, tinto berries. Huh. The moss shops. Does their feed their their food type change every time you feed them when you're trying to tame them? I was thinking. Oh, god damn it! Never fails. It's always in that same spot too. I was just thinking, might be good to get fiber. Oh. This one we're going to have to eat because I don't have any mushrooms left. Oh, that drains half your health away. I'll go stand near that plant right away. Let's see if I can find a metal node. Thought it spawned. Looked like it spawned back in, but I guess it didn't. Oh, let's go over by that plant real quick. Oh, that's two of them. Oh god, I'm dead. <laughs> I hate those things. They're, they're basically, those things to me are the true dons of aberration. 
run into those stupid mushrooms so try to stay clear of them died right next to the healing plant <laughs> oh, the scorpion's helping me tour for him <laughs> where's my oh he's gonna kill him though Didn't want to pick up my body. I want to get my stuff. There we go. Man, there's a lot of earthquakes. slow now because I don't want to earthquake can knock me into one of these stupid mushrooms I could just imagine playing this in first person when you get that effect. That must be me all the time. must mess your your head up. It's just in third person. It makes me dizzy. You get used to it. Hey, I caught a scorpion, level one forty-five. Whoo! Those could be useful for. Um, those could be useful for. Um, for uh, taming. He killed the Spino. He helped me. I was gonna try and uh, tour for it, but he killed it instead. But yeah, that's how I got him. Yeah. Um, I've, I've thought about that too, but I don't know how, like, there's tour for mm -hmm. it. Doesn't seem, like, he was doing more damage than he was doing tour for. Where'd he go? I, th I wonder if there's a way that you could. I wonder if there's a way you could set up so that it doesn't use its pincers, and you could, while you're shoot tranking I'll look it. it up. I'll look it up. Yeah. Because I, I think there is a way. Because I know you can use it for taming. Yeah. <clears throat> and I haven't really used it before for that, but it would be a good idea. I've seen uh, people use the horse. That's why I'm kind of curious I've about using it. using the horse. Yeah. But the horses are not the easiest things to tame either, so. There he is. And whatever you do, don't go near their babies. You just go near them and they'll attack you. Regular kibble from the machine. It'll be faster. 
I just remembered. I gotta get some meat. Well, let's go find. Now, what level are you? I got a spino tail trophy. I'll put it in the storage. You can use that for uh, artifacts Le later. Level 30. Or for uh, offering, rather. Keep running. split all this meat and let it spoil i should just i should start making um piping and make a toilet a lot easier than waiting for the meat to spoil uh, do you have metal over there uh there is metal i'm waiting for it to spawn back in Do you remember where that metal was that, uh, no? no? Oh, uh, I, you know what? I think I've got it marked still. So hang on. Yeah, I've got it marked yeah. on my map. Yeah. There should be a couple of nodes, nodes over there. Uh, it's not, I don't think it's going to be worth it. So I'm going to, I'll wait. I've got rotten meat in there, in him right now. Once, once we're able to get into the blue zone, to get a Anki, that'll come in handy because we'll be able to, even with one or two nodes, we should be able to get a couple of hundred. I need to get some flint. Again, trial bite went under the ground. I almost hit that over raptor. I don't know what he was running from. Flint. We need a whole bunch of flint. A nice looking over raptor. For ah, oh, I did it again. God oh, damn it. Oh, huh. well, at least the bag didn't disappear. Well, that's good. Actually, got all the stuff that I lost earlier. I thought I lost it, but I didn't. All right. Put that there. Drop that in there. This can go in there. Let's oh, shit. 
Oh, no, there's scorpions outside. <laughs> <laughs> what level is it? Level 140 female. Okay, let's make some metal. Well, I'm running around on the iguanodon right now. I'm able to dodge it easily. You know what? Iguanodons can hit pretty hard, but... I don't I, want to kill it. Yeah, I wouldn't want to mess the with... female is worth something. Mm-hmm. What's your melee at? Do you have a pike? No, I'm using... Um, so you could probably take a scorpion out. All you have to do is back up and keep stabbing it as you back up. Usually that... I don't want to kill it. Oh, you, you want to... I want to tame it. Okay. Hmm. All right. Should be able to get a full set of flak armor shortly I know what I can do I'm right by the um, trap what's up oh it's a oh 145 trike I could probably tame this from outside, but the problem is if it runs towards that gas main, I can't go near it. <laughs> okay, let's put that in there. Man, do I got a lot of green gems. 273. And that's not including what we have at our other base. And I don't, uh, what's his, where did he go? His torpor is 2,400. Probably going to take about 40 arrows. 16 simple kibble. We got a male juvenile. Yeah, and a female. Ooh, if I killed it. Yeah, they're not that easy to kill, though. And it's too close to my base. I don't want it wrecking all my stuff. Let's make some more spark powder. Must be nighttime up on the surface. There you are. Eh, it's midnight, or one of yeah, mid just past midnight in uh, game time. Get this out. Oh, did that, uh, no, it hasn't spoiled yet. There isn't very many places to look for metal here. Oh. Something busted. I think I'm having issues too. I wonder if the, yeah, that computer. I think the computer shut off with the server. Oh, okay. Yeah, because um, I can't. Just give me a minute. I'm going to go check it. Okay. Because I can't, I can't arm anything. And I can't do, I can't even get off the Iguanodon. Yeah, I think we're going to get kicked in a couple of seconds. 
Ah, that damn computer. Okay. Yep, there we go. <laughs> it just got kicked. Yep. Okay, I'll see if I could get up and running. We only got about a half hour, so hopefully it doesn't take long for it to reboot. If 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 it does, I'll let you know. I'll be right back, guys.
All right, guys, we are back. Not sure where it left me. Way to hell back here. <laughs> see we'll just checking to see what I got on my person by the way SD I got your message I'm gonna copy that over to a notepad and I'm gonna go move it over to my other computer I'm gonna try to finish off what we're doing here first and then we'll probably <laughs> hopefully when SD goes back into the game he because I think he was in the middle of taming something Hopefully that didn't mess things up. I don't know. Somebody's calling me. Don't recognize the number. It says suspected spam. It's important though, leave a message. That's uh put this guy down, turn on his light. Well, he landed right on the smithy. He sent me back before I put food into him. So okay. Still knocked out. Okay, that's good. I was worried that you would get stuck. Like, are, um, are you would end up with something around it that spawned in on yeah, him? Yeah, yeah. No, it went back quite a bit. I, even, I don't know where that... I don't think it even spawned in that female scorpion again. Okay, good. That means I didn't really damage the <laughs> Yeah, um, I'm probably going to have to shut down the server after because I want to... I'm pretty sure it's the. it's got to be the power supply. Um, it's doing what it was doing before. There's nothing else running on that computer. Like, I only have the server running. There's nothing else open. So, oh. yeah. And when it shuts down, everything stays, everything shuts off. You can't hit the power button to turn it on again. And the only thing light, lit up is the LEDs on the memory that I have in there. So that does sound like a power supply issue. Yep. It so like it just kind of like froze. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I'm gonna. What I might do is turn that computer off today take the power supply out and maybe see if maybe it just needs to be cleaned out a little bit more because i did clean it out before but maybe i just didn't do it thoroughly enough so how old is it it's old it's, then it's probably not good anymore probably yeah it. yeah but i ain't it's happening like until after that ain't happening until after uh christmas so well, how big is that one right now 650 Really? And that's not enough just for to run one thing? Wow. Well, that's why I mean, maybe it's just failing because it's old. Yeah, oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah so. Yeah, yeah. So I'm probably going to upgrade to a, I'm going to get an 80 plus gold in the new year. So. Yeah, I've got an 850 in mine right now and it's still fine. Mm -hmm. I got a thousand watt in this, in yeah, the gate, in my ga gaming computer. So. <laughs> yeah. I could change, I could probably put the server on this computer if I wanted, but the problem will be is 
anybody that joins the server will be automatically i think don't quote me on this i'm pretty sure that you get bound to the person that's hosting the server i'm not sure if that happens when you're but also i don't know if but i don't know if this this computer will be uh strong enough to run the game my stream and the server at the same time so that might be putting a little bit too much stress on it yeah no you don't want to do that all on your main computer yeah another thing i could do but i wouldn't be able to transfer the server files over uh, if there's a way that i could do that i could probably move it to my laptop my laptop probably could run it but it may not be as good a quality and it may be a little laggy because it's not my laptop is nowhere near as powerful as that computer is okay what was i doing i think i was trying to get more metal This is that Parasaur I killed earlier, I think. Okay, these guys are still here, so that's good. All right, let's go hunting. We'll find some animals to kill to get some food and some... I'll probably keep the server running for a little bit longer so you can complete what you're doing there. I'm just trying to get this female scorpion, that's all. Yeah. While the male's taming up. Man, there's a, <laughs> there's a, a lot of... Scorpion now taming. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> there's a uh, lot of... A lot of over raptors in this area. This would be a good place if you're breeding because having over raptors actually help with eggs if I'm not mistaken. Uh, uh, stealing eggs or something? They st no, they no. they also pick up eggs, yeah. Yeah. Don't they also help with like I think they help with the breeding. Yeah. I forget what though. Specifically what they do to help with breeding. Keep seeing these light beams coming down, but I think that's from the surface. There's a green drop up there. How the heck do you get up there? Okay, let's go see if we can find metal nodes in places we don't normally go. Okay. Should have brought the light pet, but I don't want him to die. <laughs> also if we run into raptors i wouldn't mind killing a few so we could get some meat and some hide slowly I'm not gonna run I'm gonna slowly run into the or go into the area where the, I saw that yielding earlier just don't want to aggro it so it follows me down
I think the climbing picks would come in handy. From, I guess they were glitched at the beginning when they first launched Aberration. But apparently it's working now. I don't know. <laughs> so apparently if you click the if you click something while you're climbing, it would you you across the map. dark over here it's hard to see wow so the males level 145 mm -hmm. and the females level 140 what's their stats like because if they get both of them have good stats on either side you'd be you'd probably be able to breed a pretty good stats look decent 2000 health 225 melee every time i see those stupid light bugs i'm thinking That's a I'm, I'm thinking it's a yielding but it's just a light bug males a little bit lower 1300 health 255 melee though so the melee's decent on both. Mm-hmm. Be nice little guard dogs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can just keep them out front. You just we push. Make, um, what are they called? Dino leashes? Are they available in... Uh... I'm going to check. Maybe that's not until Genesis... Might be extinction as well. Oh, I see okay. the yieldings. Oh, there we go. I see yielding. Flying kind of close, so I'm going to move the other way. Yeah, it must be later. Damn. So how, mm. Do you know what would be nice is those, those net projectiles. Oh, we don't have those yet either? No, okay. that's that came out on Genesis 2. I never played Genesis, but I played Genesis 2. Yeah, yeah, same here. I don't want to play Genesis. It's the same as this. Yeah? yeah you don't get any flying mouse. Any Oof. flying dino. That's why I prefer Genesis 2. <clears throat> I'm actually looking forward to Extinction, because I, I think that's when the owls came out, eh? The, the snow owls? I, I don't know. I thought they came out Genesis 2 as well. Cause I know they're on Ragnarok. Cause I that's where I teamed one for the first time. So uh, apparently they did release somewhat of a roadmap, but then again, you gotta take that with a grain of salt because they haven't really met their quotas on those. <laughs> But, uh... <gasps> Sorry, Sarko. Just outside the base, level 25. Should be, able, trap? should be able... Should be able to... He should, yeah. He, he'll probably stay in there, too, because, uh... No, I'm going to stay in the trap. If he can't oh. get in, I'll stay out. Ooh. I've got 36 shots left. I should be able to get him. Fell into a... I wish that river was a little deeper. It would be a good place to jump right now. Running already? No, no. Just, uh... Yeah, running. Oh, him? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's yeah, that's right. Oh. Here. Hey. Got him. <laughs> you know what, though? I need the meat. So I gotta... I gotta kill him. I'm sorry. You're only at 25 anyway. I think you you get I'm pretty sure you get prime you get prime meat from uh Sarkos, don't you? Sorry dude. Stand around here and get some health.
Ooh. Gems. I'm going to play for another few minutes because I had to stop because of the server issue. I really, actually, technically, if I wanted to, I could go a lot longer. Oh. Bugs you, moron. That's half my health right there. What the hell? A little bit of food. Yeah, the their Elden the Neebs Gaming Elden Ring series. Um, I think they can only play two at a time. I'm not sure exactly because they they were able to play multiplayer, and they're only showing two groups of two, but pretty. And I, I think they made. I'm not sure if that game allows you to change what your guy looks like or not, but uh, okay. they, uh, their guys look like really goofy looking. Oh. Cross eyed, big, big giant noses. <laughs> That was the trike that I was looking at. Okay, let's see if we got any of our metal finished here. Oh, wait. Because of the server issue, my metal didn't actually cook. That's cr that is ridiculous considering how big they are. They're not that big. <laughs> it's maybe because the saddle's mostly high. Mm. That's what it is. Maybe I've got enough here. Man, I wish the the drops here were a little bit better. Kind of like it's for some reason the scorched earth drops were in Incredibly, like, like, if it wasn't for the drops, f some of the times I probably wouldn't have been able to get as far as I did in that game. <laughs> Scorched Earth was fun, though. I had a fun time playing that. Yeah, I started making a base right near the river. And mm -hmm. Yep. I think what it might end up doing is building near, not in, right at the obelisks, but at, like right oh. nearby the obelisks. No, I, I did one right at the obelisk on my first playthrough. Yeah. Yeah. I can't remember which one though. I think it was the top, the top right one, like the, the north, the northeasternmost one. Because I just built on one of the plat. I built my base on a plateau, and then I built yep. a ladder system going down. I didn't even build a ladder system because I'm, cause, um, I'm playing on Omega, so I've already got mm -hmm. my, uh, mm -hmm. my flight suit. Yeah. And I was able yeah, to... Yeah, no, I you would need a ladder system. Yeah, what well, actually, it, eventually the ladder system became an elevator system. But yeah, yeah. my biggest issue with, with when I played Scorched Earth the last time... Uh, is I probably should have started should have started getting my army ready a lot sooner for the boss fight because there was a lot of 
a lot of um, too much time it took too much time to get the babies baby uh, wyverns all because it each wyvern took up to seven hours to tame so yeah yeah That's crazy. well once I get I think on here yeah but yeah they're big animals and and they I know. but I got them all fully imprinted and they were they wreck the manticore so oh, yeah. awesome. I I could have probably did the I think I could have probably got away with doing the beta but I just did the gamma I only used, I think it was 15 wyverns. Only. Yeah. <laughs> Took a long time to get them all going, though. And then I had a couple of that I ended up breeding, so I didn't have to go get eggs all the time. Sorry, I'm just keeping track on these. Um, yep. Yeah, I'm just trying to make metal so I can make more, uh, make some more, uh, flak armor. Or, I'm actually right now making spark powder. I ran out of angler gel. I think I got the angler gel from a drop. Okay, 200, and, oh, 260 metal. I think it's what, two? I should get like 160 metal out of that, maybe. Okay, has that metal spawned across from us yet? Hard to tell. I'm going to look up where to f where the entry points for the up because we don't have to go outside but I'm figuring those little apparently the entry points is where you can get metal and stuff so Speaking of hide, okay. I I need to make bowls as well because I want to probably next time I play, I'm going to probably. I'm going to try to get some. Uh, some more hide here so I can have a saddle for that scorpion when he wakes up. I'm going to try to get, get a, t try to tame a raptor or something. Yeah. Why don't you just grab one of one of the ones here? Oh, never mind. You're yeah, far that that would yeah. <laughs> that could be disastrous. I don't want to lose the raptors, especially if we're doing good over there. Once we have, I think once we're up to a point where where we can confidently travel between biomes, or but from where I'm at to you, I think we just yeah. meet up together and then we'll just guide everybody here. Or yep. Maybe we'll, maybe at that point we'll have, uh, cryopods. I mean, we're at the point where we could probably make them soon. And I have it where you don't need a fridge to deploy them, so. I'm seriously thinking about possibly playing official. PVE, just finding a server that's not that populated, or at least just where, like, because if it's overpopulated, trying to find a good place to build something is hard. <laughs> then you got the ones that are not populated, but people just left the server and never came back, and you can't build there because of their. And also, it might be a good way to meet some people. Um, 
Um, I don't play unofficial so much. I I, I prefer the unofficial because I, I I like mods. Yeah. In all honesty. Yeah. I've tried official. It's okay, but it's pretty. It, it's people tougher. Are, it is tougher. People are, are kind of toxic on the official servers. I've noticed. Yeah. It, that's why that's another reason unofficial is better people are less way less toxic way more friendly mm -hmm. for some reason i don't know why oh parasaur is wrecking a probably a a raptor over here might be able to get some free hide and meat yeah i've got nowhere near enough hide to make my saddle that's fine yeah it's definitely a I don't want to get close to those guys because there was a place where I was able to jump across. I thought it was here, but it's not. Oh, that's a, that's an Iguanodon. I thought it was like a piranha or something. It poked its head out and it's kind of stuck in the water here. Level 90 Iguanodon, but he's, he's almost dead. I think it's drowning actually. Oh no, it's getting health back. No, it's stuck. It's stuck in the water. It's stuck in between. I'm watching your stream, yeah. Now I'm stuck. I just want to see, I'm going to, oh, looks like the Parasur with the, with the yay hide and meat you done messed up there raptor oh a bag here oh arrows i'll take those arrows i might as well take everything Ooh. That was a dumb move for that raptor to take on a level 100 Parasur. <laughs> oh, there's another one here. Oh, two of them. Level 25. Yep. Nice. You know what? I should probably make some bullas now. Let's get some stone. Uh, I think we need some thatch. Oh, there's another one here. Look at that. That Pariser took out a pack of raptors by itself. Oh, oh, there's a dead dodo over here. <laughs> probably gotten the line. Probably gotten the line of fire. <laughs> Oh, I used the wrong tool on that. That's okay. It did give me thatch. It might be enough to make bull bulls. Nope. Oh, I need fiber. Okay. Uh, let's get our... Need more thatch. Oh, he lost some levels. That's okay. Um. So that he's still stuck in the water. Ah, he's, he's safe. I don't think. The good news is there's no piranhas in this this river, so. Mm -hmm. The river where you are is probably more dangerous than this one. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. I've seen that. Um, well, I've I know for a fact that there's uh there's piranhas in that river because I've been eaten by them. Oh yeah. 
<laughs> oh, I think these are good. Ah, let's skip my. I think these give you. Sorry, he's not level 200, he's level 193. Pretty close. It's not. Well, it's still 193. Yeah. That's not bad. What's his attack at? Let's see. 293. Cool. Okay. 300 melee already. Is there anything? Oh, I'm dehydrated. Great. Four bullets should be enough. I have to make some. I still gotta make. Uh... Bola. No, I need. I need to make some um, narcotics. Once those bulls are finished, I'm gonna head back to base. Oh, I do have a pike. So yesterday when I was playing, I got chased by a bunch of um, healings. And they, one of them was on the wall over here. And it's not here anymore, so it must have been killed. Oh, I see a drop, and it's not far from our base. Yeah, I think I'll stream for a couple hours on YouTube. Oh, what's that? I thought I saw blue gems come down, but I don't know where it landed. Come on, guard boy. Oh, it's a ringed one, too. This might give me something good. A ghillie mask and trank arrow. One trank arrow. Oh, it's a blueprint. An ascended ghillie mask. Not bad. I'm nice. going to drop that. So we don't, don't need the trank arrow blueprint. You got rid of the ascended ghillie mask? Blueprint? No, no, I dropped the. I had a blueprint for a trank oh. arrows. <laughs> then, that, that ghillie mask. Oh, no, the, it, it's not Blueprint. It was actually the mask. Oh, the actual item. Okay. Yeah, so now I got a... I got a ramshackle ghillie chest plate, or chest uh, piece, and uh mask. So, just need the boots and the pants and the gloves. Because building ghillies not... Well, I, I guess if you... If you could get a strong enough creature to take out a Carcanos, you could get a lot of uh, silica, or not silica pearls, um, what do you call it, um, organic polymer. And you need organic oh. polymer to make the ghillie suits. Yes. So, but the, the Carcanos give you tons of organic polymer. I'm sure there's not many penguins around here. Yep. <laughs> I think there's a. I think you could get organic polymer for one of the mushrooms too, but I'm not sure which one. Ooh, what level is that turtle? Ten. I'm gonna send my scorpion after him. Okay. Hey, hey peaches. I haven't seen you my this morning. Go get it. Split get it. this stack. Actually, let's split it in half and then split okay. this yeah, 19. Yeah, 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 get him. Yeah. And maybe we'll go. <laughs> He's running. Gather some narco berries. Nice. Good job. Checking to see if. He actually did torpor him before he killed him. Oh, cool. cool. Yeah, 
so it does work. That's so I'm wondering if you put him on passive and you use the tail, right? Attack. I'm, huh? I, I wonder. Well, that's what I mean. If you put him on passive and attack attack while you're mounted on him, and use the tail attack oh, to get yeah, the torpor yeah, up. Yeah. It should work. And then. I've never tried it. Yeah, that way he doesn't actually end up killing the, the team. I've never tried it either, but I'm just thinking that might be something we could science. <laughs> Yeah. I thought we were getting. I didn't realize it was just knocked out. I thought it died. Do but yeah, uh, he knocked it out before we killed it. Do turtles uh, refrigerate stuff? No. Uh, th what was I? Th some I thought someone. Or I guess they. You could put. Oh. Wait. Every animal does. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Every the animal basically keeps things more. Um. They last longer. Yeah. 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 They, all, every animal is the same. Every animal is a refrigerator. Uh, like that's another thing I should probably work on. Is... Oh, and the mushrooms. Well, those mushrooms. There's a, um, another iguanodon that, that I saw in the distance. Um, but this girl is about to wake up here in a minute, so I'm just going to wait. Maybe I can have them both attack from both sides. <laughs> the iguanodon. How much does it cost to make a toilet? Oh, you know what? The cliff pat platform is not that expensive. It's actually cheaper than the. It's actually cheaper than the, the tree platform. Well, it's expensive, but it's not nearly as expensive yeah, yeah. as you would think it would be. Yep. And I think it would be doable. I think I'm gonna make one. And maybe set it up near the edge over here so that we could safely try to get into the blue zone. Actually, you know what would probably help with that is those spiders. We have the spiders. So, um, hey, Bugsy. Uh huh. If you open up the tribe list now, you'll see that we've got the two scorpions. Uh, it's the um one the not yeah to the right of the tribe manager yeah mm -hmm. there it is it's that list right there tracking list it showed them all for a second there Plus guard there. boy guard boy yeah. and guard gal, guard gal. <laughs> yeah. I like it because you said guard dogs but they're not dogs so <laughs> oh you oh yeah you got a ravager muta man. Oh, that's cool. Well, the male. That was the, the, the young one. Remember? Yeah, I wish I didn't kill that stupid. <laughs> oh, I felt so bad, time. too. I was, like, so mad after that happened. I was like, God well, damn it. Whatever. Look, I lost the Carno. Yeah. So I'm trying to make up for it by getting other things right now. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to get us set up for moving on to the next zone. That's why yeah. I came over here. And I think we're in a good spot. I'm gonna probably expand the base soon. I gotta, I'm gonna put some wings out here. I should All probably right. try to tra tame this doad again. But I gotta get, I wanna get some more metal to put into the vending machine so it's a little easier. Because mm -hmm. the timer's so short on that. Waiting for this meat to spoil so I can make some narcotics. Oh, there we go.
Because it doesn't take a lot of shots to take out a, a raptor. No. Even a high level one. I'm going to get rid of everything that's on my in my inventory. Now there's something I don't think you'll ever need in this map is uh fur caps. <laughs> I wish this had a this um in Conan Exiles you could dismantle your armor and get all the get half of the resources back. Yeah, does it work on does it work on armor and stuff? I wasn't sure. I'm pretty sure. I know that it breaks down wood into thatch and. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it works on armor as well. Works on armor, works on weapons, works on anything you throw in there, basically. As far as I know. I would get all my resources at one point just because I would go when I was playing on Genesis 2 I'd be going to all the different drops that would show up and so any items I didn't need I would throw into the grinder and I'll get so much metal so much polymer or um, what's the stuff you get from penguins again uh yeah organi uh, organic polymer organic polymer yeah you get a lot of that it's nuts but that's because you're if you're breaking down the gilly stuff you get the organic polymer back which is cool it's so funny too because i on scorched earth i i got one in a drop never used it for very much so uh, gilly? no uh or the polymer. no the the grinder oh yeah i had, had it set up Honestly, right next It's kind of funny because I, I ended up getting like a whole bunch of windmills and drops, and you don't get stuff like this on this map. Okay, we should be able to make a couple of suits, or at least a couple of pieces. No. Oh, we're. Sh I didn't put the metal in. That's why. <laughs> Dumb. Oh, I need to make a helmet first. And what was else I needed? I think boots. I wonder if there's a way that we can transfer items across the map. Because I'm, I'm making a suit of, uh, I'm making a suit of, um, black for you as well. Almost got a full set. The only thing I'm missing is the helmet, so I'm just waiting for 10 more metal ingots. Where'd the baby go? I should go grab yeah. some... <laughs> My next round of metal is going to be for putting into the vending machine so I could get some kibble. Would a baby wanted on or a juvenile rather still give a hide? They should. Yeah. You'll get a bunch of you should get a bunch of um That's why it's good when if you run into a raptor and it has a baby. 
you could kill the raptor or try to tame the raptor and kill the baby and then uh use the prime meat to feed the raptor oh yeah not a bad idea but it's very hard to find the babies they usually you know what the funny thing is they usually stay around the mother and if they get too close you could accidentally <laughs> stab the mother reduce oh, the yeah. Oh, I forgot to bring my... I went and made narcotics and I forgot to... Uh... I can't wait because we're gonna have access to gas orbs like crazy once I get the. I've never used those yet. We're gonna I'm need sure them for the. Yeah, we're gonna need them for the glider suits. Oh, okay. Yeah. I've never used that. And also, we could. I think the gas orbs help with the. You can make a zeppelin. I'm sorry, a zeppelin. Yep. What do you mean a zeppelin? I think it's in the thing. That's a flying machine. Yeah. Oh, level 92. Shit. Huh. Yeah, I think it's part of the Bob's Tall Tales thing. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I, yeah, that, that that would make sense. Wow. Badass. Hey, Cosmo. A 35. 23 Titan. You know what? I have exactly 23 Titan on me. Get over here. He took off. I forgot they went away. Yeah, and uh, the um, I think the the yielding is a Bob's Tall Tale thing. It's, that's... I hate those things. They suck. Because you can't... They fly. They don't fly. They glide around. And you just can't... You can't do anything against them. You have to wait till they land to try to stab them. How do you get the Cosmo to not shoot at you so you can um, give it kite again? Oh, oh, just stay out of the red area. And then... Oh. Yeah, and just gotta, you just gotta go in slow. Don't rush. Oh, cool. So don't rush in, okay. Yeah, because he's in the red. Oh, green, okay. Hi. Don't be red anymore, okay? He'll hide his eyes for a second, and then... then. Forget it. <laughs> yeah, they're, you know they're a pain in the ass. <laughs> yeah. And then they start green. going... Yeah, and then they'll start... When I walked in, yeah. red. Yeah, when they start to... Uh, Moving into areas where it's really dangerous too, it's a pain yeah. in the butt. I, you got to try to find a nice place. I'm wondering if trapping them inside a building, like building a building around them, might be. I forgot to grab the freaking narcotics again. We'll go, we'll go around and test that theory. Mm -hmm. What is this blue area here? At some point, I'll try to tame one of these horses here, because apparently, like I said, the, they're supposed to be really good at knocking things out. There's a lot of Equus around here. Equus, that's what I was, the word mm -hmm. I was looking up. Mm-hmm. I didn't realize that's how you pronounce it. I usually just say, usually I just say a horse because it's basically a horse. Actually, they're closer to zebras. Yeah. I didn't, re but no, I didn't realize they were called eggless or pronounced that way. I was way off. 
Okay. Let's make those trinks. I really should look in. Maybe once I get some more metal hero, start maybe working on getting a long neck built. Yeah, I thought you said you made one for me. I looked in the, the smithy and I didn't see any. No, I think it's because I I grabbed it. Because <laughs> oh, okay. I I I was in a death loop and oh, and it really, yeah, it was not good. <laughs> It's so easy to get in the death loop, especially in that area. So far, I haven't had I to deal with that here very much, but. Getting here, I had to deal with it a lot. Because once, like, even the fertile lake is pretty dangerous. I might end up having to go back there if I want to get a spino or something. I was thinking there's usually in this area here there's a lot of uh, sheep or ovis I might be able to uh, take down a couple of raptors and feed the mutton eat that that's the thing with the foliage here. You can't see when those mushrooms are coming up. Where I've seen them spawn before, I'm not seeing any now. So you gotta use a red, uh, 15 blue gems, 50 concealed gas balls 20 green gems 10 red gems eight charged batteries and where do you get element or that's how you make element i think that's the only way you can get it i'm not sure if uh rockwell drops it you, i would hope so because that's the only way to get it anyway i'll be back Yeah, you know, let's go into the area where I saw those. This wasn't so far from the water. This would have been a good place to set a base up. I'd like to go further that way, but I'm worried about those yieldings. We'll take a look. Oh, look at the baby bulb dogs. Seeing the yieling flying around now. Oh, there it is. I can see it. It's attacking that Diplo over there. I'm trying to see if that yielding's taking any damage. It is landing. Oh, there's a couple of them there. Level 100. Oh, it did take some damage. Must be something high level over there.
See, there's a pathway going up there, I think. Problem is, is there's healings and they suck. 95 and a 100. Oof, that would be rough. I'm not going to go there. Nope. I got to find a way to... I got to look up to find out how to tame those. Because I think if we had one on our side, probably be for the best. What the hell? Oh, I bet you... One of the big creatures probably knocked over one of those mushroom trees. I am starting to get hungry. We're going to have to end this stream soon. I haven't eaten since 7.30 this morning, so... <laughs> Just check in to make sure because I keep running in those stupid mushrooms and they take half my health away. 29, level 8. Wouldn't mind getting a doad. Probably would help with base construction over here. Do we risk going over here? Because I know there's yieldings up this way, but I haven't seen any pop up lately. So let's go take a look. There's that high level Equus. Gotta, gotta watch out for that. Oh, that, he's coming after me. Oh, shit. Why? I didn't do anything. I didn't... Eat, that baby came to me, not to... Oh, shit. Of course, the baby Aquas comes running to me again. Last time I was up here, there was healings. One twenty-five. That's a female. Already got a female. Okay, we're gonna just gonna go check up here real quick, and then I'm gonna probably wrap up the stream in a little while. I want to see if we could get. I'm also kind of curious to see. Yeah, this is pretty much running towards. Not actually, I'm kind of heading towards. A look on here. Yeah, our base is that way. I don't want to go too far away, but let's see how far we can get without dying. If I see a yielding flying around, I'm taking off. Oh, we got some raptors over there. Level 60. 27, 25. I don't know if we can handle three of them. Oh, there's more than three. I think there might be four down there.
Now, I am wearing heavier armor. Oh, 135. So there's four of them there. And one of them is a high level. Huh. That's not what I wanted. I Like if we could get that one by itself. I don't think they can get to me up here. But I say that and they might see here. Yeah, I don't think there's a pathway up up here it, they might end up getting stuck but I don't have the range to really and I kind of want to go over there <laughs> okay well Let's abandon that plan. Let's see if I could sneak past them, though. Those over raptors are a pain in the ass. Okay. We went down this way before. So I think this is where the raptors were coming down to take on these these guys down here. Okay, our raptor hunting isn't going to happen today, but at least we know where we could probably get. Oh, there's one there. Level 90? Ah, oh, that kind of works. Get our bowls ready. Let them eat that dodo. Come to me. Oh, dumbass. I might be able to take that. Raptor's getting its ass kicked. Well, oh, now he's running. Tables turned for the Stego. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> nope, he just killed. Just killed the Raptor. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I don't know. No, he did. The a stego, level ten oh. stego took down a ninety raptor. Huh. Maybe his health is already low. Yeah, it was. He was. It, this these things attack anything. It doesn't matter. <laughs> oh really? I don't think they care about their health. They just go and attack. Oh. If it's in the area, they'll just go after it. The only thing they won't go after is something that's a lot bigger. That's, like it won't go up. Yeah. That's 
That's like three times the size of a raptor. Maybe yeah. four times. Yeah. And, and it for... wasn't scared of that. Nope. I think it's just the herbivores, though. It won't go after the... I've never seen them attack uh, Rex or. Uh, oh, that would make sense. Yeah. Or anything like I. Oh, if... you know why? Hmm. The stick is a herbivore. Yep. That's why. I just realized. Yeah, but that's why it doesn't go after the Rex. Mm -hmm. Rex is a bigger carnivore. Kind of the alpha. Yeah. Predator type thing. Yeah. Then you have the Giga. Giga or Karchar. The Karchars are pretty, actually, are more deadly than the Giga. Because I think they cause. I, I can't get one. I don't know how to get one. Oh. Yeah, they're they're a little bit, t they're a lot trickier to tame because you got to trap them. Yeah. Then you got to feed them. And then once they're fed yeah. a certain level, you got to ride them and try to hunt yeah. with them. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's not. It's a, it's a chore. It's mm -hmm. not like too much of a chore. That's why I like the Gigas. They're they're not they're they're difficult to tame, but they're easier to tame than a Karchar. Yeah. I'm actually probably on the island before I go and do the final boss. I'm probably going to end up doing trying to get uh, a, a a decent level Giga to clear out that volcano because there's always a like on ASA, there's always a Giga or a Char, Archar in there. Where? Right inside the volcano. Although the one that that's in the one that I'm playing right now right. is trapped in the wall, so it can't move. Oh, yeah. So. I forgot. Yeah, you're right about that. It's always inside now. Like yeah. The boss. Yeah. The last boss. Yeah. And then there's a. Usually Alpha Rexes and stuff in there. I'm actually thinking, because I've heard going after the Overseer in that game, the best fighter, the, the best animal to use is the... is the... Um, what do you call it? The Tickle Chickens. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, they're uh, really. Yeah, because huh. they they do a lot of damage with those claws, eh? I would assume so. Yeah. Yeah, they're apparently really good boss fighters. So. Anyway, I think I should wrap the stream up. I feel like I accomplished a lot today. I'm going to look up and see if there's a way that we could teleport stuff to each other. And if we can, I'm going to see if I could get this flak armor to you. You can put on a mod if you have to. I'll download it. I don't know. Yeah, I was thinking maybe I'll look into that teleporter mod. There is one, yeah. Yeah, because I know you could get teleporters once you have the tech stuff from the after you fight the bosses. Well, I've got, yeah, but I've got like, hey, when I play on Omega, I don't know if it's part of the Omega mod or what, but I've got like a... It's a small one. It's like a personal teleport. Yeah, yeah. Um, That's available. Yeah. You can get one. I, I don't know how much it costs to build those, but we'll, we'll have to Nothing. look into it. It's like... Um, let me think. Most, most of the mod stuff is like I, I think hide it's 20 or... Metal ingots. Either yeah. 20 metal ingots or 20 metal, something like that. Yeah. So yeah. It's, it's cheap, regardless. Yeah, I'll look into it, and I'll probably add it once... Uh, I'm going to try to figure yeah. out a way to make this computer a little more stable if I can. Like I said, I'm trying to run it without anything in the background running. So anyway, I got to. Yeah, it was, but I don't know. Maybe something turned on. It, it was running fine yesterday and the computer was running all night. I just had this. Yeah, I just turned this. I turned the server off. We don't have any babies going right now, do we? No, no, oh. I, you, I, yeah. you, I wasn't going to do anything until you fix the settings. Okay, I'm so going to... Why don't we do that off stream before yeah, I'm, you leave Discord? Yeah, um, well, cause I can't because the computer is like on the other side of my room, of the 
my living room. So, uh, so what I'm going to do is going to copy and paste those settings. And once I shut the server off, I'll add them in. But I, I'm going to keep it running. So if you want to stay on for a little bit and do stuff, by all means. Copy paste those settings because those settings are already in, in the... No, no, no. I'm going to copy and paste it onto a note book and put it on a flash drive and I'll take it over to the other computer and just copy them. I'll just add them into the settings on into the game user you settings. Have to add them in. The settings are already in there. You just need to adjust them. Yeah, that's what I mean. Okay. I'm just going to copy them from your from the copy the the settings, Don't. not the actual things, just the settings. Don't copy the settings over. No, 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 no. No, that's what I mean. I'm going to use those settings, but I need a I need a visual reference. Okay, okay. That's why I want to put them on a notebook. Sure. <laughs> yeah, all right. Just making sure that we, I, that I understand yeah. what you're going to do. Yeah. Yeah, there's, there, if you already have those settings in there, if you just copy what you have in there, mm -hmm. I don't know if that's going to cause issues. Oh, and I was going to ask, so I think I'm going to add that. Remember that, that one I told you, the uh, death um, recovery thing with the personal gravestone? I'm going to add that in as well. That. That way we just don't have to... Off. You don't lose anything on, on death. Just change that option. Yeah, I'll have to, have to look and well, see where that is. already an option in the game. Yeah? Yeah. Let me take a look. Where you don't lose anything on death. I'm pretty sure. Seven days to die has it. I think this game does too. I'm pretty sure. Oh, you're out. No, I'm not. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just, uh... Wait, Just checking to see if I could find the uh, just the graphics. I think I have to wait until I shut the game off in order to yeah. see. Oh yeah, 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 you do. You do. There. Oh, uh, I think I have. And you were asking why you don't see the green um, damage counter. Yes. I think I have that turned off. I'll turn it on because I like having that too. Yeah, it's nice. To, I, I love seeing the numbers. Yeah, I think the reason I, the reason I think it's automatically turned off when you start the server. So yeah, I'll I'll just yeah I'll switch that I'll switch that to true. I think that's all I have to do on that. Because because yeah I prefer that. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap it up wrap up the stream for today. I'll be back on actually if you want to come check me out on Tuesday. I'm actually I'm not sure yet. Just keep an eye out. I'll probably put a post on Discord and on all my social media to let you guys know what I'm going to be doing. On I'm hoping to do Tuesday stream on YouTube because I want to do more. Mm -hmm. Right now, your schedule on your page. Mm -hmm. this, you, this week only. Mm -hmm. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, 7 to 10 p.m. Yeah. So that's not valid? No. <laughs> okay. okay just no. no, that's probably you know old... I don't know why it probably just re reset to the what I had before. I actually changed that and it, stuff like that manually. Yeah. Um but yeah, gonna be streaming here next week. So if you wanna join me next week on at nine o'clock next week, nine AM to I might go longer, we'll see. Today we went pretty long. Almost went five hours. So, <laughs> yeah, I got to get something to eat, though. I'm starving. Anyway, I'll uh, see you guys next week. Bye.